job roles in IT networking. What kind of job roles you guys can get as a suppose if you learn IT networking. So you can see there is a network specialist, network technician, network administrator. So there are a lot of job roles, okay, or job designations. So maybe when you start your career, maybe you are going to get a job as a network engineer. Maybe some guys are going to get a job like maybe a VoIP engineer or maybe data center engineer or telecom engineer. So first of all, you need to start your career and maybe the job role is going to be different. Okay, like, uh, but yes, most of you are going to get either network engineer or maybe network uh, security engineer. Most of you are going to get technical support engineer because technical support engineer also sometimes is the job role in IT networking. There are many networking ke job roles and there is no job role ho sakta aapka after any when you get into IT networking. So maybe as a fresher you are going to get a job as a network engineer. Maybe after some experience you are going to become a network specialist and uh, maybe network administrator, network solution architect. Okay. And uh, so networking is a big field. Like many, many companies are looking for engineers to configure router switches. Some engineers configure firewalls. Some engineers configure IP phones. Some engineer configure the wireless network. Some engineers are configuring networking in cloud. Okay. So networking is a big domain real world maybe you have 50 kind of jobs in it networking like network automation engineer okay so there are lot of roles what knowledge you should have but if i recommend you like if you want to get job in it networking as a fresher okay or if you want to shift your job okay so you can see we should have good knowledge on these topics like tcp so tcp udp Okay, and um, OSI model, MAC address, subnetting, TCP, DNS, ping, trace route, DHCP, telnet. So all these topics, if you see, this is all these topics are related to IT networking. And if you have good knowledge on firewall or maybe little bit of Linux, okay, quality of service. Okay, so these are some of the important topics if you want to get into IT networking. So in IT, there are different different type of roles system and infrastructure department there is a network and security department in the company and there is a software development vertical so who all are system and infrastructure engineers so any guys like big data engineer cloud engineers data analyst database admin site engineer system engineer devops engineer all fall under a system this system infrastructure category Okay, so, but what do you all have to learn if you want to get into system and infrastructure, maybe guys are going to learn a lot of Red Hat programs like, so this Red Hat is a Linux. So you learn about Red Hat, you learn about virtualization, you learn about Linux courses and advanced uh, courses like uh, uh, certified Kubernetes and all, okay, Docker, Kubernetes and all, Oracle, AWS, Azure. So this is where the companies, the engineers are going to manage the servers. Okay. So when you are going to build the infrastructure inside the servers, you do not configure router switches, firewall. So these kind of jobs are called system engineers or system and infrastructure engineers, kind of cloud engineers also kind of because cloud engineer is just a general term. So then we have network and security. You guys can become normal network engineer or uh, network NOC job. What is NOC? Like NOC is called Network Operation Center. So you are going to manage the company network from these big screens. So in India, ATL office and all. So you will be going to see that ATL has big offices and where the engineers are managing or monitoring the company networks. But yes, maybe you will not get to monitor these networks as a beginner. Okay, so means uh, this area is for maybe for advanced uh, engineers. Okay, so for big companies like uh, like if you get into AT&T, which is a US company and if you check their NOC, which is very big, like I think world biggest network operation center in is from AT&T. Okay, which is headquarters in US. Okay, so this is called network operation center. Same like NOC stand for network 
ऑपरेशन सेंटर एंड दैट्स व्हाई एंड यू हैव सिक्योरिटी ऑपरेशन सेंटर आल्सो मींस हियर वी मॉनिटर द कंपनी नेटवर्क एंड देयर इज अ सिक्योरिटी ऑपरेशन सेंटर वेयर वी मॉनिटर द कंपनी अटैक्स ओके इज देयर एनीवन हु इज ट्राई टू अटैक माय कंपनी नेटवर्क और ट्राई टू अटैक माय like bank server or something so any security whether it is physical security or whether it is a softer kind of vulnerability cyber security and all so these type of thing are called soc so soc there are a lot of tools in the market or tools and softwares okay so in security operation center maybe you need to learn uh, q radar there is a software from ibm which is called q radar okay so these are some of the examples i'm giving you here maybe some of don't know anything right now what i'm talking but as a security operation engineer these are some of the tools to aise kuch software hote hain jisse aap monitor karte ho company mein as a security operation center engineer okay soc engineer so these skills you need to develop as a soc engineer so you can see security tools like mdr edr dlp investigation okay so our platform and all so this is what you have to learn okay so if you want to get these kind of jobs like soc jobs or noc jobs you might have to learn certified ethical hacking ccna cssp so some uh, courses are there to become a cyber security or network engineer so currently we are going to talk about like network and security is like combination now in the companies means if you are a network engineer and if you are a cyber security engineer so there is high chance that you are going to work under one department okay that is network and security department and there is a system and infrastructure department where cloud engineers so devops engineers all these engineers are going to work under system and infrastructure engineers i have created a road map here okay so what is this road map that how you will start your career okay to kafi log start karte hain ccna or maybe they start from very advanced programs okay but they don't know exactly where to go so this is network fundamental so how you can prepare for network fundamentals so you can go to our youtube channel okay just type here network fundamentals so you can see here day one introduction networking course and there are like 2 3 5 7 videos and i think uh, so you can watch from youtube okay there is a 6 hours course here also computer network fundamentals you can watch this also okay so once you complete the network fundamentals so once you have basic knowledge of network fundamental you can do self study of network fundamental to aap iski aap self study kar sakte ho so but after network fundamentals you have to go for ccna so don't worry this is not the end this is the start of your network engineer career CCNA बहुत बेसिक कोर्स है इन आफ्टर सी सी एन ए यू हैव टू गो फॉर सी सी एन पी एंड ट्रस्ट मी मोस्ट ऑफ द फ्रेशर ऑल्सो लर्निंग सी सी एन ए एंड सी सी एन पी बिकॉज नाउ डे सी सी एन ए इज जस्ट ए नॉर्मल कोर्स एंड इफ यू आर वेरी सीरियस अबाउट मेकिंग करियर इन नेटवर्किंग देन एटलीस्ट यू हैव टू गो फॉर सी सी एन ए सी सी एन पी दिस इज माई रिकमेंडेशन ओके so uh, ccna can also help you to get a job but most of students who just complete ccna they always complain that i am not getting too many calls i am not getting selected and all and maybe you will get less salary also if you just stick to ccna so if you are happy with maybe very basic salary okay then it's fine ccna is also definitely good certification but if you are serious that you really want to get into networking properly then ccna ccnp so what is the ccna which is cisco certified network associate ccna is a first level which is a exam you can become a certified guy also so if you have done your degree in it so this is the international certification so once you complete the course you have to give this exam and the exam cost is little high so in india it's around 20 to 25000 so around 350 dollar because if you ex- give this exam you will be going to get this international certificate ccn is a basic program after that you have ccnp okay so ccnp full form is cisco certified network professional so this is a professional level course and definitely you will see a lot of jobs opportunity in big companies once you complete ccnp 
so do not just join ccnp for training okay if you guys can afford definitely go and complete ccnp certification also okay so you will be definitely going to see a good high in your company okay so maybe you are going to get good salaries in next company okay but yes you should be having a certificate which will prove that you have knowledge but without knowledge if you are getting certificates okay then that is going to be piece of paper only so this after ccna ccnp go into advanced program like we recommend people to get into palo alto kind of this is a firewall okay so you can learn any firewall okay i would recommend like people to go for palo alto which is definitely a good firewall and it's easy for you to understand so if you really want to become network engineer okay as a beginner also i would highly recommend you to cover these three programs within 6 to 7 months okay so once you complete this apply for jobs and definitely you are going to get a job then i still recommend you to go for ccna ccnp and any firewall koi bhi firewall aap pad sakte ho but i recommend palo alto firewall so palo alto is a good firewall it's a device where you are going to configure this type of firewall for to configure in the companies to secure your company network and in the companies like palo alto firewall is deployed so you will be able to understand the company network properly okay so why firewall is important so you can see currently in the market what is going on like you have branch office one branch office two like delhi mumbai chennai or uh, more different locations so how you are going to connect all the locations together that you are going to connect all the locations with vpn tunnels and normally all vpn tunnels are configured on firewall okay routers are also capable but in industry we mostly use a firewalls okay so these are the firewalls in the market okay if you really want to know so ccna ccnp mein kya hota hai so in ccna ccnp you are going to configure cisco router and switches okay so these are cisco devices so which you are going to configure that is not only devices you need to configure in companies you need to configure firewalls also ठीक है तो राउटर स्विचेस तो करोगे ही करोगे बट यू नीड टू कॉन्फिगर फायर वॉल्स एंड लिटिल बिट ऑफ वायरलेस नेटवर्क सो मीन्स कंपनीज आर लुकिंग फॉर गाइज हु आर हैव लाइक मल्टीपल डिवाइस नॉलेज व्हाट इज द रोल ऑफ नेटवर्क इंजीनियर सो फर्स्ट द नेटवर्क इंजीनियर शुड एबल टू कॉन्फिगर राउटर्स शुड एबल टू कॉन्फिगर स्विचेस फायर एंड इफ दे आर गुड एट वायरलेस देन दिस इज अ प्लस पॉइंट तो ये चार चीजें okay these four things are important then definitely you will be stable into this job role which is network engineer okay so ccna ccnp firewall will help you to get stable into it networking and later on like there are advanced programs which you will be able to learn like sd wan or load balancer and uh, slowly slowly you guys can learn cloud and then you can become a cloud network engineer which is in demand and then cloud security engineer but freshers can't become cloud network engineers directly if fresher is thinking that i want to become a cloud network engineer in future then he is thinking right okay but if you are planning right now that i am looking for a job as a cloud network engineer so first of all let me tell you cloud network engineers jobs are for experienced people okay so not for freshers if you want to get into high paid jobs suppose you become a cloud engineer or anything but if you want to get into big like dream companies okay so what you all have to add in your career dream companies are like aws google whatever so you can learn about python for network engineers okay, so this is extra knowledge you have to get okay with aws you are going to learn so python for network engineers okay, so once you and this is how you guys can go into dream companies okay if you do not learn programming what is network automation still you can become a cloud network engineer but maybe not in big companies okay so this is why i recommend you all to go for like uh, after ccna ccnp firewall maybe you learn sd wan and all then cloud then python then you can apply jobs in these kind of 
companies many many people just randomly putting youtube videos that there is no demand of network engineers or maybe is the end of network engineers so weird i think the people who never worked as a network engineers are creating those videos ओके okay, तो मैंने कई वीडियोस देखे हैं जिनमें लिखा हुआ है लोगों ने कि भी फ्यूचर है या नहीं है नेटवर्क इंजीनियर का क्यों नहीं है हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू रन इंटरनेट इन द कंपनीज हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू यूज वाई फाई नेटवर्क हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू प्रोटेक्ट यूर कंपनीज विद फायर वॉल्स हाउ यू आर गोइंग टू डू दैट बिकॉज इफ यू आर से सब कुछ क्लाउड में जा रहा है ऑल द सर्विसेस टेल मी डू यू थिंक ऑल देयर लैपटॉप आर ऑल्सो मूविंग टू क्लाउड नो दे स्टिल ब्रिंग लैपटॉप इन द कंपनी जस्ट इमेजिन तो अगर आपकी कंपनी में इंजीनियर आ रहे हैं सपोज यू वर्क फॉर एनी कंपनी देर आर गोइंग टू बी लाइक 100, 200 एम्प्लॉयज इन योर कंपनी दे ऑल हैव लैपटॉप्स, राइट सो ऑल दीज लैपटॉप्स डेफिनेटली दे आर गोइंग टू कनेक्ट विद वाईफाई और मे बी विद इथरनेट केबल सो दे नीड डिवाइस दे आर कॉल्ड स्विचेस सो नाउ टेल मी इफ एवरीथिंग इज मूविंग टू क्लाउड डू यू थिंक ऑल द एम्प्लॉयज आर गोइंग टू मूव नो All these laptops are going to connect us still with the switches. And tell me, do you think they will be able to access internet without router? No. Still, we need router in the companies, right? Okay. Maybe you do not need firewall because you do not have servers. So when you need firewall, when you have company servers, in this case, you are going to have security kind of a firewall devices. So this is a firewall. so in this case you will have firewall and you will be going to get connection from internet okay so this is internet you get connection okay you put it in firewall then maybe firewall forward to router and then these servers are also connected with the switches okay so sometimes this firewall is after the router also okay so this is all the design what you understand in ccna ccnp firewall okay So I'm just telling you कि ऐसा हो ही नहीं सकता कि कंपनी सबको बोले कि ऑफिस ही मत आओ ओके नो कंपनी इज गोइंग टू लाइक बिग मेनी मेनी बिग कंपनीज दे सेड वर्क फ्रॉम होम बट नाउ दे आर अगेन आस्किंग पीपल और एम्प्लॉयज टू कम बैक ऑफिस अगेन राइट सो इट मीन्स देर विल बी स्टिल ब्राइट फ्यूचर फॉर नेटवर्क इंजीनियर ओके लाइक यू आर गोइंग टू प्रोटेक्ट द कंपनी सर्वर्स इन क्लाउड ऑल्सो बिकॉज इन क्लाउड ऑल्सो यू कैन डिप्लॉय ए पॉलोल टू फायरवॉल तो आप क्लाउड के अंदर भी ये फायरवॉल डिप्लॉय कर सकते हैं ओके सो इफ यू हैव गुड नॉलेज एंड यू हैव क्लाउड नॉलेज देन यू आर गोइंग टू कनेक्ट यूर ऑफिस एंड यू आर गोइंग टू कनेक्ट विद एडब्ल्यू एस एंड दिस डिवाइस विच इज द फायरवॉल पॉलोल्टो दे आर गोइंग टू कनेक्ट यूर ऑफिस विद द पॉलोल्टो एंड ऑल्सो मे बी विद योर डेटा सेंटर so still firewalls are going to be used inside the cloud also theek hai to aisa nahi hai ki demand chala jayega ya kuch ho jayega either people who are creating those videos they do not have full knowledge okay so you should always check their authenticity they worked for good companies if they have good knowledge do not follow anyone blindly networking cloud cyber security will never end ओके सो एटलीस्ट फॉर ट्वेंटी थर्टी इयर्स इफ वी मूव टू मार्स वी गेट एनी डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी और बट स्टिल आई डोंट फील लाइक नेटवर्किंग विल एवर कम डाउन मे बी न्यू स्किल्स यू हैव टू लर्न ओके आई ऑलवेज गिव वन एग्जाम्पल लाइक देर इज अ सॉफ्टवेयर इन अकाउंट दैट इज कॉल्ड टेली मेनी मेनी ऑफ द अकाउंटेंट दे हैव टू लर्न टेली एंड दिस इज वाई Like all the accountants today, they should have tally knowledge. Tally is a, just an accounts software. So in India, if you want to get become an accountant after BCom and all, maybe you need to learn tally. So now tally is not killing the jobs. Tally ne kya kar raha hai? Bas ab accountant ko tally aana chahiye. The same way, network engineers are safe, but in future they need to learn some automation so that network engineers. With automation will be hired in future. Okay, right now network engineers are safe, but now they have to learn tally to survive in the companies to get a job. The same way in future, just network engineers want to upgrade in automation kind of things like a little bit of programming. Okay, it's not too much programming. Software engineer जो सीखता है ना ten percent of what software engineer do 
you that type of coding you have to learn not more than that if coders have 100% knowledge so just remember maybe you have to learn just 10% of coding this is what is going to happen in future okay network engineers they just have to learn coding little bit that's called python for network engineers this thing but still if you don't learn for next 3 years you guys are safe बट मेनी मेनी कंपनीज आर मूविंग टू ऑटोमेशन देखो यही चीज है कि अगर मार्केट में हाइप आता है ना सो लाइक देर इज अ वेरी बिग हाइप इन ऑफ क्लाउड फ्रॉम लास्ट टू थ्री इयर्स हर कोई क्लाउड सीख रहा है एवरी वन इज लर्निंग क्लाउड फ्रेशर आर ज्वाइनिंग एडब्ल्यू एस बैचेज एज योर बैचेज इट्स डेफिनेटली गुड थिंग बट यू कांट जस्ट इफ फ्रेशर लर्न एडब्ल्यू एस अगर कोई फ्रेशर एडब्ल्यू एस कर रहा है तो उसको जॉब नहीं मिलने वाली क्लाउड इज अ प्लेटफॉर्म नॉट ए स्किल सो दीज नेटवर्किंग लाइन एक्स okay so these are skills okay so this is the road map these three programs are amazing like if you learn csna csnp palo alto then definitely you are going to become a network engineer